Question 13. The diagram shows a shaded octagon on a square grid. Remember, an octagon has got eight sides. Line A joins two vertices of the octagon. Vertices is just a posh word for corners. So this line A is joining two corners of the octagon. It's joining that corner and that corner, or that vertex and that vertex. One corner is called a vertex. You don't really need to know that to answer this question, but while we're on the subject, we might as well say it. So, join two other vertices to draw a line parallel to line A. Okay, now then, all you've got to do to the, for this one, to get a parallel line, is put your ruler on line A, and then simply slide the ruler across and keep sliding it until two corners are joined. Well, we're already past this corner here, and it's not joining another corner, so that doesn't work. Keep sliding that doesn't work, keep sliding and eventually you'll get two corners that work, now these two corners here are now joined to the ruler and we haven't rotated the ruler, we've just literally slid it from there without rotating it up to there and that's the answer to that first part of the question there's another, there's a line that joins those two corners you don't really need to extend the line, so we'll just rub that out Okay. So that's part A. Part B of this question says to join two vertices to draw a line which is perpendicular to line A. Now perpendicular is a posh word for at right angles to. And a right angle is 90 degrees. So we basically need to draw a line that makes a 90 degree angle with this angle A. Now there are two possible answers here, so we'll use a different colour for two answers. So if you get your ruler and put it on there like that, all you've got to do is join to another corner that's going to make a right angle. And you can see this here now makes a right angle. So one answer you could possibly do is to do that and join that line to that corner. It does say join the vertices. So the two vertices we've joined there are that one and that one. And we've made a right angle with line A. The other possible answer which we'll use a different colour for, is to go at the top here and join those two corners. And again, if you join those two corners, you'll make a right angle with line A. So there are two possible answers for the second part of the question. Just to go back to this one, the first part of the question, the reason why those two lines are parallel is because those two lines are pointing in, in the same direction, they're pointing the slanted upward direction like that and they would never ever meet if those two lines were continued they wouldn't ever meet or ever join and that's what you need for two parallel lines 